every part of their relationship is full with stress. Even the good days, he's afraid that it's going to be ruined. Even in the best situations of them all, always something is wrong because he's not pure. The man is worried because of his sin. Edag mechatati. He's afraid from his sins, from his avonot. Because that he's not clean, so he still always have stress. But now he said, Baruch Hashem, we don't have that problem anymore. He's still married. His wife can call him in the middle of the day to tell him, come here, what are you doing? Can scream at him in the middle of the day. Everything is regular. What changed? His peaceful and quiet changed. And it's a salvation. It's a Geulat Israel. This is the salvation. That you're free from all lusts and desires. You're a free man. You're not longer a slave of all of your lusts and desires. When a man is inside all of those lusts and desires, he's always afraid. He's always in stress, always in anger, always blaming himself. Feel weak. Feel that he's a liar, that he's missing something, that something is wrong, that something can happen. Because he's a sinner, because he's not clean. He hasn't completed his tshuva yet. But when a man is cleaning himself with a complete tshuva, then the sins are not blocking the light of his neshama anymore. And then he sees that he just wants Hashem. He sees his neshama. And he's not longer afraid. What I'm going to do? Where I'm going to have money? He doesn't care. He knows that he wants Hashem and this is what that counts. I'm going to eat. I'm not going to eat. I'm not going to sleep. I'm not going to sleep. I want to serve Hashem. I want you. Kirvat Elokim Litov. To be close to Hashem. It's good. It's good. I feel good. I'm close to Hashem. I feel good. I have one shoe, one sock and a hole on the, on the thumb. But I don't care. I'm with Hashem. I feel good. I'm happy with Hashem. That Hashem is here. It's just a temporary world that in this world, in this period of time, we have a mission. What's the mission? The mission is only not to forget the Creator. To remember that it's all Him. Never to fall in the trap of all of those coverings, of all of those hustles.